Mid-season patch. Uh, a little earlier than usual. Balance team is going bolder with this one in particular. And we'll, we'll mainly focus on tanks. I am so not looking forward to this, bro. This is gonna be fucking awful. What's happening right now is that this is the worst season Blizzard has ever released. And the player numbers has ha have halved in two weeks. So they're so desperate of making this game better. They're releasing the, the mid-season patch two weeks early. Now, the issue is... What the devs think the game needs is the exact opposite of what the game needs. So they're going to make it even worse and exacerbate the issues. If you guys don't know what to expect today, they're going to make tank across the board even stronger. Insanity is doing the exact same fucking thing over and over again. Expecting shit to change. Even though it's already the most impactful role in the game. But instead of bringing anything else DPS wise up, they're going to nerf the two or three outliers that are really good. So it's gonna double amplify the issue. We're gonna have unkillable tanks and DPS is gonna be all useless instead of three characters being viable. Um, so the game is just gonna be completely awful. Hero updates. The armor changes have had a positive impact on which hero and damage types are slowed down by armor health. We're increasing the damage reduction on it to further widen the pool of heroes that are significantly affected by armor defense. Armor flat damage reduction increased from 5 to 10 per projectile. If you don't know what that means, anything that shoots fast does even less damage. And one-shot characters or characters with high burst potential like Cassidy will be even stronger. And this is a nerf to Tracer, Soldier, Hanzo Storm Arrow, uh, Bastion, Sombra. Basically any DPS that is not Cassidy, Sojourn, Farah, the characters that are already OP. Anyways, we continue. <laughs> Tank roll passive ultimate generation reduction increased from 30 to 40 <laughs> percent. Knockback resistance reduced. All right, like a slight Lucio buff here. Developer comments the maximum duration of defense matrix is increased by half a second by reducing the rate at which the resource meter drains when it's in use. So it won't take longer to regenerate. The increased damage on micro missiles will help the ability feel relatively more impactful against larger health pools. <laughs> Double diva buff. <laughs> uh, we've been asking for this for years. Thank God diva is finally good. Doomfist. Overhealth gain per target increased. Delay before overhealth begins to drain increased. All right, let's continue guys. Junker Queen. Overhealth increased! <laughs> Mauka! <laughs> Alright! Knockback damage increased! Stomp damage increased! Duration reduced of cutting overdrive! Lifesteal increased to 100%! 100... 100% 100, uh, 100 lifesteal! One... <laughs> damage reduction increased! Let's go gamers! Ramatra! Bonus armor increased! Pummel damage increased! Reinhardt, maximum health increased. Barrier regeneration rate increased. Wall impact damage increased. Impact damage increased from accretion from 40 to 80. Double the damage. Let's go. Sigma buffs. Woo. Primal rage, maximum health plus 200. Woo. Zarya, health increased. Duration increased. Health increased. Duration. <laughs> I can't. I can't. It's a joke. Like. If you showed me these patch notes on April Fools, I would have laughed. Damage will passive now only half as effective against tank heroes. In addition, <laughs> Tracer's so good, dude. <laughs> they they overbuffed every tank. <laughs> and then they overbuffed the ta the armor. I'm not taking any damage. And the passive. And the nerf the DPS passive. I am beyond words. Someone leaked these to me before, like two days ago. I thought it was a joke. <laughs> Bob now gains tank roll passive abilities. We need more tanks in the game. This is the 6v6 edition, boys. 6 versus 6 is back, boys. Finally. Cassidy, 
Primary fall off damage range rescaled. Big Cassidy nerf. Good nerf. Actually, it's gonna make Cassidy less deadly long range. Farah. They realized that it's maybe a dumb idea that a boop ability does 30 random damage. They somehow thought it was a good idea to like buff the rest of it. This is all of it. Farah is still gonna be the only character that's being playable. Uh, she's she's even better than before because Cassidy got nerfed. It's more it's more it's be Farah is better. Like Farah is better. That's all the changes, by the way. That's that's it. That that's the DPS changes. Okay. What? Support Anna. Sleep dot even weaker against tanks. Basically, uh, not useful anymore. Zenyatta ultimate cost decreased. I don't know where to begin. That the like I don't think the devs want to kill their video game. I think they're truly just too dumb to understand what the issue is. I said this before this patch. I don't think it's a bad idea to make tank more tanky. But on the same page, you need to reduce the damage tank deals. Otherwise, it will be even more oppressive. So they literally just went ahead and made tank unkillable. And they truly think anyone is going to play this shit. I don't know how stupid they are to think that this will make Farah less meta. Especially considering that again, like the only person that could hold Farah at bay is Cassidy. Their goal with this is to encourage people to shoot anyone that is not the tank, right? To give the tank more freedom to do their job. The issue with it is that, yeah, it's not going to be valuable to shoot tanks anymore, but now they're just going to kill you for free every time, so you can't do anything, right? Because they still do insane damage. And the fact that, like, on a lot of, a lot of tanks, they buff the damage the tanks do as well is crazy. I'm gonna win this game, right? Make Metro? sure, make sure to fucking heal me, Alchemist. Of course, I play um, tank. I'm, only I'm actually like mega fucking drunk. Not really, but like I, I consumed like a bottle of soju when I met the person. Okay, I missed a few punches there, but I mean my team died before. How does he have shadow already? It's fucking crazy. Jesus fuck. Me dying to the other tank over and over does prove my point, by the way, for the smart asses in chat. Rhino P? Question mark? I don't know. I'm just gonna ape in here, okay? Okay, three to one okay. aping. Ow. Wait, it works! Yeah, you can keep eating here, I got you with a physics. This is literally just me taking a pocketing on the <laughs> nice, nice. That's your job now, Alchemist. Don't complain. I'm fighting the second tank, the six foot. I'm fighting the tank. Tank down, tank down. Yeah, I killed him. Oh, it's okay, I have a hundred percent lifesteal yeah. in overdrive. Don't worry. Did they change Mauga recently? He asks. <laughs> he doesn't know chat. I'm going in. I'm got backing out here and it's like, okay, never mind, never mind, yeah, yeah. You're playing tank, it's really good. I love Overwatch! Great game!